Hey guys, John here. Welcome to 5 Minute Presets. Today we're in Diva, and today let's make a nice, smooth, creamy super saw. So let's start the clock, and here we go. So for our preset that we're going to be starting with, let's go to the presets, to the templates folder, and let's select the init digi hubi. And right off the bat, we're already pretty close, so we have a couple super saws, so let's do a little detuning here. And down here can get a little bit muddy, so let's go to maybe two for the high pass. Okay, so let's add some extra voices. So for our voices here, let's go to the max 216 and stack some voices, maybe four stacks like that. And then let's start panning these by selecting here, go to stack index and increases to the right to taste. Okay, so let's work a little bit on our envelope here. So we need a little more release. Bring your sustain down. Something like that's kind of cool. So let's do a little filter here. Okay, so let's go to our trimmers and then maybe for one of our voices, let's bring this up an octave. Ooh, that 20 kind of sounded a little bit nice. Let's go something kind of like that. Okay, so let's add a little bit of chorus, something like this here. So let's add some delay here. So delay two, let's turn this on. Okay, let's kind of EQ this a little bit more. So we have two, three, and three. Let's maybe go for a four right over here and two, three, let's see how that sounds. Key tracking. Okay, so we're getting in a good spot here. And what we can do for this as well on the detune amount, we can always increase this a little bit more to get a little bit more of that nice detuning effect. Add some more voice drift. So we have that constant pitch wavering going on here. Okay, so I think we're in a good spot here. So let's do some external EQ right here. So we have our EQ open, and I like to take out that mud because it gets kind of gross at the bottom there. Kind of like right there where it seems like it's underwater. And since this is nice, rich super saw, we can always give some extra top end. And maybe let's see how this sounds for the high pass here. That's a little too much. Maybe two is fine here. Okay, so that's okay here. We have 17 seconds. So let's run this a little bit to our external reverb, which is Valhalla Vintage Verb, and see how that sounds. Maybe 
too much delay here. Let's bring your feedback down just a little bit. And the low pass a little bit more. Okay, so time is up here, so let's see how good we did in five minutes. Let's see. Sounds pretty nice and rich. Pretty cool. So also what you can do with this, I'm going to save it like this, but keep in mind, you can always go back to the main here and you can always enable a arpeggio. And have a lot of fun like that. So I'm going to leave these settings right here. I'll just disable the ARP and we're going to save it just like this. And I guess we're just going to call this a Detune Super Saw because that's pretty much what it is. You can't really name this anything really else. All right, so if you want to get this Detune Super Saw, there's a link in the video description below and it can be yours. Hopefully you learned something and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.